Oh, thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you, thank you. <clears throat> thank you. Like the, you probably heard the famous actress Elizabeth Taylor once said to her sixth husband, I won't keep you long. <laughs> but, uh, and I won't, but I, I do have to say, this, this is a real inspiration. And listening to, to the earlier remarks, particularly those of, of Dr. Cole, you, you keep hearing the same names as I go around the state over the years, getting older and learning more. You keep seeing the same things when you have great success. There are always names that pop up in different places. And listening to these names, Zucker, Gene Reed, uh, Beth and Darius Rucker, Tommy Baker, Charlie Darby, Boeing, the Tourville family, Sean Jenkins giving of his treasure, Kelly Lord giving of her time. It reminds me how great the people of South Carolina are and how strong we are when we have a vision and we determine we're going to do something. You may remember the great Mark Clark commented after World War II that there's more patriotism per square inch in South Carolina than any place in the world. I also believe there's more strength of purpose and determination in South Carolina than any place in the world. And I trace it back trying to figure out historically we're living in paradise. You can look over at the water and see that. Go up to Greenville, go anywhere in the state. We're living in paradise. All the explorers said so back in the 15, 1600s when they were writing back to their sovereigns or taking messages back to their sovereigns. This place that we call now today South Carolina was the most fertile, most beautiful place of all the, the new world. And when you combine that with the great military tradition that we have, and you combine that with the great tradition of Judeo-Christian faith that we have, you end up with some people that are strong, determined, and accomplish things and will stand up. So I believe when we communicate, collaborate, and cooperate, when we have a vision, when we're creative and we act with confidence, we can produce the kind of success that we're celebrating here today. I don't think it gets any better than this. I don't think, if looking out at all of you from, from where we are, I don't think there's a, a stronger, more determined, better looking, greater group of people in the, in the whole world than we have right here under the, these buildings in this tent. And that's why the future of South Carolina is so strong. If we work together, there's no stopping what we can do for these children to make this the best place on earth to live, work, and raise a family. So on behalf, as your governor, on behalf of just over five million proud, happy South Carolinians, I want to congratulate you and thank you for this great step forward today. Thank you. <laughs>